10% of his focus. Finally, I've got about a minute left, and I've got to ask you about the subject everybody is talking about today. You know what it is, and that is the fact that you went to see the Broadway musical Hamilton on Friday night. And afterwards, uh, the cast addressed you as you were walking out of the theater about their concerns as to whether Mr. Trump will protect diversity in our nation. Here he is. We truly hope that this show has inspired you to uphold our American values and to work on behalf of all of us. Yeah. All now, Saturday morning, Mr. Trump tweeted this. The cast of Hamilton was very rude last night to a very good man, Mike Pence, apologized, and he tweeted about it again at 623 this morning. Governor, what did you think of the cast comments, and did you consider it rude? Well, first off, uh, my daughter and I and her, and her uh, cousins really enjoyed the show. Hamilton is just an incredible production, and... Uh, uh, incredibly talented people and uh, it, it was a real joy to be there and you know when we arrived we heard we heard a, a few boos and we heard some cheers and I nudged my kids and reminded them that's what freedom sounds like and uh, uh, but at the end I you know I, I did hear what was said uh, from the stage and I can tell you I, I wasn't offended by by what was said I'll leave to others whether that was the appropriate venue to say it but I, I do want to say that um, that uh, the the basic element, the, the center of that message is one that I, I, I want to address, and that is I, I, I know this is a very disappointing time for people that, that did not see their candidate win in this national election. I know this is a very anxious time for some people, and I just want to reassure people that what President-elect Donald Trump said on election night, he absolutely meant from the bottom of his heart. He is preparing to be the president of all of the people of the United States of America. Uh, and to watch him uh, bringing together people of, of diverse views, uh, bringing together people that differed with him strongly, seeing him talk to leaders around the world, I, I just want to I just want to reassure every American uh, that that in, in the days ahead, I'm very confident uh, that they're going to see they're going to see President-elect Donald Trump. And be a president uh, for all of the people and and we embrace that principle and we're going to work hard to make that principle every day that we serve and just to button hamilton gate up do you want or expect an apology well i, I as i said i would just i would leave that to others whether that was the appropriate uh, venue for that but uh you know, I, I will tell you, Chris, if you haven't seen the show, go to see it. It is a great, great show. And, you know, and I'm a, I'm a real history buff. And so I, my daughter and I and her cousins really enjoyed it.